Girls are meeting together to foretell their future. Only at that night it is possible to discover the name of the future husband, gender of the firstborn child, who from girls would marry first, and the lot of them. They usually start with preparations. Some require a lot of materials. For example, now girls are cutting paper and writing names on it. There are a lot of other things. You can cook varanike and give it to the dog. Whoever cooked the first eaten varanik will be the first girl to marry. Back to me. You put candle in the plate surrounded by names written on the paper. And the name that will burn will be the name of the future husband. Another very interesting divination is discovering the fate by melted box. You should interpret it the way your heart is telling you. But some of the most common are about, that means good news, or a monkey, for a false friend, a person for a date, a plane for a trip, and so on. You can also repeat it with coffee or tea residue, ashes from paper, or necklace. One of my favorite is predictions from the book. You ask the book a question and randomly open the page. Then, with closed eyes, pointing on the row, you will find the answer. To discover the gender of the firstborn child, you will need a needle. Throwing the shoes over the head will point from which direction your future husband will come. small part of what girls can do. There is also a lot of things boys do on Santa and Tuesday, but it will take a lot of time to tell everything. Come on, come on. Come on. Come on. 